want to watch this video is a vlog we're going to see an Irish house which for me will be like a palace then two another ruins of a little I think also an Irish house then we're going to a park for a walk and then we're going to sheep's head for a longer walk so the first one was almost 5k and the other one is almost 10k so I hope you're going to enjoy it just go and do a car travel so go around and see beautiful views or discover new places I don't know how to give up but that means I can do a bit of car knitting um, so you've seen I have hat this is my pattern and Streckles hat and check the links down below then I have Navelli on me because even though it's June well I can wear it it's a cropped nice fingering weight sweater I uh, love it so much maybe I will need something similar um, we shall see and I'm wearing and I'm wearing socks so obviously I won't be sticking the legs out but I recorded something like this and these socks they haven't been knitted by me um, break because I see beautiful views. Oh, check this out. Do you see it? Is that green? Is the green I see? Let me know. Check it out. So back to the socks I'm wearing. On the screen over here you can see them. I'm wearing them for the first time but I got them I think. I think I got them this year. Um, so yeah. I was holding them, enjoying them, and now I'm using them because that's what the knitter would want uh, you to do if uh, you're getting something from a knitter. Does that make sense? Anyway, what do I have in the bag? I have two things. Well, I digged up a very old gift that I got a while ago, maybe two years ago, I'm not sure. If anyone remembers when I got it, I think I either got it with an order um, as an extra, it's 100% organic cotton 50 grams, 105 me meters hand dyed with avocado. And by order, I think that time I got a ba lymph balance. So, and though I didn't, wasn't getting a yarn, that was just kind of extra, extra. So, I want to knit something for uh, our new house or to our new house because that time we were renting and I did not want to start using it in an old house and I was just holding it to. Um, dream and now I can say our dream came true so yay don't afraid to dream and the next thing so what I want to do I just want to make a beautiful ball yarn with it so I will be I don't know how you say it I'm not making a gallon cake I'll be making a ball and I have socks and I started them two at a time with the toes but then I divide them to um, nine inch circular so second thing um, I have a toe over here and I'm knitting on the foot of it here and I'm using leftovers uh, that my friend sent it to me when I finish I'll tell you all about what I'm using so stay tuned over here Yay! isn't that pretty I'm mixing two yarns I wasn't sure would I have enough or I didn't wait it I wasn't sure enough would I have enough left over to make with the contrast colors heels and toes the um, socks probably could but I didn't really bother to wait the yarn okay let's see where we go to
everyone it's sunday as you can see and we decided to go for a trip to take the day off and just leave the house <laughs> um i'm wearing my knitwear over here um, and this is designed by skin deer and oh i forgot the name of the the sweater but it's a fingering weight if you're interested to knit fingering weight yoke kind of reglan then uh top down sweater i would recommend it it's really really nice um yeah and i have my socks on maybe on the screen over here i'm going to show you what that is and this is just beautiful but before we do that we're going to have breakfast now let me know have you planned any little car trips around your area lately As you can see, each floor, I presume even each room, had a fireplace. So now this is the one, and I'm standing over here. Maybe was it a kitchen over here? And then the chimney went up here and joining this one. And then as you can see, there is another one over there. One over here, one up there, and we have one over here. I'm not sure what that is there, though. And there is a corner, no, there is a tower in each corner. And in each tower, fireplaces, again. Three of those four towers were designated to be uh, rooms with huge fireplaces. I don't know even how to show you. I could ba basically sit there with my stretched legs. That's how big it is. And I believe this one was a staircase. Some somehow people were going up. This room was built in the 17th century but the architecture was kind of focused on the 16th century and you can see over here we don't have any fireplaces which would indicate that it had to be a stairway everything was wooden sorry And this door was probably used by the servants and kitchen staff and it's not an official entry as you can see the other one up there the top one was so I presume under the stairs because you can imagine there were stairs up there there's some kind of storeroom I presume I'm just guessing but I would love to see it move in time and see it how glorious it was when it was fully operational check those windows
I don't know have you noticed, but they're quite ingenious. They have small kind of roof things here, so the water bounce off, I think, of those things. And each window has that little bit to protect too. In the 17th house, 17th, what do you call it, 17th? Well, I hope you liked it. Now we decided to go for a walk. I have a jacket and Anne's Freckles, Freckles hat, my stir prototype hat, so you know. And Zeb, where are we? I don't know. So I have I'd no clue. You have no clue, okay. So I don't know either. <laughs> we check later. We will check later. Okay, so here we are. Welcome to Guargan, Guargan Barra Forest Park, and this is in county, what county? I'm not sure can you see it but there is a road just over here and we're doing a loop so we were there just a few minutes ago and we're coming back
This is Bound Tree. but we have been over here before. Well, we've been here before and we actually even stayed in the camping site one day. So if I find that I take any footage or we have video, I may leave the link down below. And we found this beautiful spot over here to sit down, move the chair and prepare lunch. Do you want to see what we eat? Come on, girls.
two down and up. 109 steps. Whoa. Yes, and I was showing you socks because I got these from a friend. So we are almost in the corner of Ireland. Ship's head. enjoyed this one see you next one and by the way my phone stopped working for those who want to contact me